my house. <laughs> and when we first met, and you were like, oh, I, I do like your ass, yes. Yeah, I, I do like your ass, it's very nice. House. 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 Say house. House. Do you like my house? My house. 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 <laughs> house. Not house. House. Not everything has to be said with a smile. <laughs> That's not true. House. Everything said that with a smile. Best, worst Christmas present. I mean, like, worst, there's like, worst is like, because it has to be like, bad enough that it's memorable. Yeah. There's lots of really bad presents, like, a book that you didn't really want. Nail varnish when I don't paint my nails is quite common. Just got no nails. Um, so worst, it has to be like what, like something really what, bad. Yeah, it has to be pretty bad, pretty bad, really bad. I would say I had like, I think I'm not sure if it was my birthday or Christmas, but I'll just say it anyway because my birthday is quite near to Christmas. <laughs> I got this doll. Um, it was like I can't remember what it was called, but it was it was like a really big doll, like. A life size. Like kind it was of probably baby. about this big now to me. But when I was like five years old, it was like huge. It was like half the size of me, and it was really scary. Like mum and dad bought it for me, and it was actually because my sister wanted it. We all sat on the bed and we opened it together, and I was just like, Julia was straight away like, yeah. Wait, did you get matching dolls or one no, doll she... to play with together? It was my birthday. <laughs> Julia chose the doll for me. Because she wanted it. Yeah, because she's you know, a bit older and she's like, I think Claudia will really like that dolly money. And then I was like, I don't like it. I was actually really scared of it. And Julia was like, oh, I really like it. And then my mum was like, well, Claudia obviously doesn't, so they had to take her back to the shop. And Julia says that she was really upset because she was quite sad because she, she wanted to the doll. <laughs> that wasn't really the worst present, but I think it was probably the only present I've received and I've actually looked at in absolute terror and burst into tears. My other, my actual worst, not worst Christmas present, but um, I got some insects that you could eat, that was a bit weird. But actually quite cool and they're weird, but I didn't eat them. No, it was like, um, uh, eau de toilette of natural smells. <laughs> like manure or grass right. was one. Who wants to smell like grass? Yeah, though? grass was one. Like these gel pens that used to I smell think, like natural stuff that they smell like I think disgusting. mud was another one. I was going to say, my worst was about that age as well, I was about 13. I think I was either 12 or 13. And you're at that kind of age where you're really becoming a teenage girl. And what you really want, if you're me, obviously, not you, are like nail varnish, <laughs> makeup, clothes, yeah. or books about history, because, you know, we all have layers. Um, but no, <laughs> the present I got given. And it was really bad because I think she meant it in a really loving way. So one of my aunts, she gave me this incredibly heavy box and it was like, Jessica, I feel now that you are 12 slash 13, you are old enough to fully appreciate and look after this gift and treasure it for what it is. And I was like, oh, what is it? This is a deeply, deeply symbolic, significant moment yeah. here. Family heirloom. Passing Alu. from the matriarch of my family down to me. Oh, was it? oh my gosh, and I opened up the box, and what was it? A bloody fossil. <laughs> Fossils? Have I ever declared an interest in such? A no. 12 year old girl, I got given like edible insects and a to toilet of natural smell. <laughs> and I was like, a bit weird, but okay. A bit weird, but kind of went along with who you are, no? Yeah. And what you enjoy. Have I ever liked fossils? Best presents. Best present ever. Mine's really easy. My best present ever I actually bought for myself. <laughs> so that? Yeah. Okay. He was my Christmas present and I bought him. It was Walter. Ah. Ah. Walter. Best Christmas present. I was like, mother, I'm going to get myself a dog. So I went to get myself a dog. Oh. And brought him back and I was like, I have a puppy now. And then I was but like, also, I'm I really want a puppy too. <sighs> so we went and bought another one. Yeah, <laughs> what was your best Christmas present then? You weren't at Christmas time, I met you in the summer. I'm a present every day. I would say one of my best presents, as I remember it, was my skateboard. Because, <laughs> like, I really wanted a skateboard. I probably went on and on. When I really want something, I go on and on and on about it, don't I? Yeah, you do. And I, like, research it to the death. She researches hard. Yeah. And uh, I think I must have made some subtle remarks about my want of a skateboard to my parents. She probably but made I thought, a poster. But I thought it hadn't sunk in, and I thought that they wouldn't get it for me. So that was really nice, because then I was like, a skateboard! <laughs> what I'm going to give you this year will obviously be your best present ever. What is your best ever Christmas present? 
and actually what's your worst, because that's far more exciting. <laughs> Let us share in your gloom of disgusting, horrible gifts that you have received. And talking of gifts, oh, who's going to get the awesome giveaway that we are giving this year? Because Christmas is all about giving, etc., etc. And here's Jesus. the thing, yeah. <laughs> and Jesus, but we're super inclusive, so even if you don't believe in Jesus, you can still get given this gift. Yeah. Super inclusive. That's what lesbians do. To enter yourself into my Vlogmas subscriber giveaway, click the link in the description to head to my Instagram. I'll announce the winner on Instagram on Boxing Day. Good luck! Come back tomorrow for another Christmassy video.